Good morning, folks. There's some solar activity we're closely monitoring today, including a rapidly growing sunspot. We'll peek in on the data from a geomagnetic storm in 2017 and end with some eye candy from the James Webb Space Telescope. We are starting with the last 24 hours on our star, and we find the eruptive activity is on the rise. Everything from small pops to filament releases created a couple big CMEs. Those were not aimed at Earth, but a potential small one is coming our way. And in addition to monitoring the active regions we already have, there's a new one deserving focus. This sunspot group didn't exist a little over 24 hours ago, but it's rapidly growing and is approaching Earth-facing heliographic longitudes. Look at how it develops here, and this one obviously will need to be monitored for flare activity as much as any of the other active regions or plasma filaments on the disk at the moment. If it continues growing today, it has the potential to become the largest sunspot group of the solar cycle so far. And it will also be worth monitoring the plasma filament to the south of it, which is also going to be entering Earth-facing position over the next 24 hours. Solar Watch, definitely elevated today. Quick peek at a paper about the September 2017 geomagnetic storms, triggered by the largest flares of the last sunspot cycle. A good review for veteran observers and a key tidbit for new viewers. While particle precipitation from the Van Allen belts is generally worst at the day side, the induced current and risk to electronics is usually worst in the midnight sector. That was the case here. It's a ring current going completely around the globe, and it tends to peak on the night side. Lastly, folks, the James Webb Space Telescope is getting unprecedented views of pretty much everything it sets its eyes on. Here, they have not only found a gorgeous ring within a nebula, but found the methyl cation, a key carbon molecule within the ring. Webb living up to its billing as it continues to show us the heavens as we've never seen them before. We greatly appreciate your support. Be sure to check out the links to observer resources in the description box below the video eyes on our star. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.